Hey, hey, it's Michelle here with your encouraging word for Wednesday. Today, we're going to look at 1 Peter 1, 3, and 4. It says, all praise to God the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ. It is by his great mercy that we have been born again because God raised Jesus Christ from the dead. Now we live with great expectation and we have a priceless inheritance, an inheritance that is kept in heaven for you, pure and undefiled, beyond the reach of change or decay. I know for many of us living in this world, it's hard for us to fathom something being unchanged or beyond the reach of decay. There's so many things in this world that are passing away or that are ever changing. So we have to understand that when we are born again, we are born again because God raised Jesus Christ from the dead. Now we live with great expectation. We must have an expectation for what God is going to do in our life now that we are his born again children. Our expectation should be for God to bless us, to restore us, to grow us, to mature us in the faith. Like we need to be expecting good things to happen to us today, tomorrow, and in the future. We can put our hope in God because of Jesus Christ, because of what he did when he sacrificed Jesus Christ on the cross. Listen, we don't have to look any farther than Jesus's birth, life, death, and resurrection to be hopeful for the future. I mean, that right there should give us an expectation for what the future is going to be like in God's kingdom. Like we have an inheritance in heaven that is beyond the reach of change or decay. And that's a promise that we can take to the bank. Like God promised it. That means it is secure for eternity. So we should have an expectant hope, a great hope for our future. Amen. I hope that word encourages you today. Heavenly Father, we just thank you so much, Lord, for your word. We thank you for Jesus Christ and what he did for us on the cross, Lord, that we can have this great expectancy of what our future holds, of the great inheritance that you have for us that is beyond change and beyond decay, Lord. We just thank you and praise you in Jesus' name. Amen.